Hey guys, it's Ronnie here with Great Choice. And today what we're gonna show you is a TV that we had previously put out here by the guy's hot tub and he uses it constantly. He says he comes out here probably every day. Uh, so in that meantime of all the you know stuff that comes off the hot tub, it's you know discolored the screen and weathered it kind of pretty bad. So today we're gonna put in a new TV and you know for all you guys who just put the regular tvs out there yeah it'll probably work for a couple months you want a tv that's going to work for years you need to pick a true outdoor tv and that's why we go with sierra because they'll last and they'll work outside and look wonderful for years to come stay tuned and we'll show you the finished result of us putting it back up here uh the sierra tv does come with its own 55 uh, watt powered soundbar we are not using that soundbar we have one from james loudspeaker with a couple speakers that we have around the pool and a subwoofer over here so stay tuned and we'll show you those as well hey guys this is ronnie with great choice back out here at this uh outdoor tv next to the hot tub now that we've got the new one back up here with the soundbar mounted underneath if you'll take a look behind here you can see how the mount works. It's got some levers right here that you can lock it in. Put your padlocks there. Put your padlock on this side so nobody can come up and steal it. And then we ran our wires up through here and then out to our sound bar and then into the back panel of the TV where all your inputs are hidden behind this uh, panel here. Um, so with that being said, you know, you look at the sound bar, it's got a special little bracket that holds it underneath and makes it flush with the front of the TV. And it does provide really good sound. And we went ahead and we provided, and we're using a MXW920 universal remote, which is water resistant outdoor remote. So we can operate our sound, change TV channels, whatever may be the, you know, so with that being said, we'll show you the subwoofer and the two satellite speakers we've also got out here. So, and it has rained quite a bit and it looks like the flower bed actually raised up the subwoofer a teeny bit. But that, that's common whenever you're trying to do in a flower bed that's next to concrete. That's where the water is going to try to settle is next to your house. You always think about that. Um, with this particular sub, we couldn't go very far just because of the foundation of the house. So that's why it's like that. But as you see, we got our satellite over there and that over there. And then the sound bar off the TV to work all the same. And being out here in the country area, they didn't really have great internet. So Sonos or some, you know, streaming music f services and, you know, Pandora and stuff didn't work quite well. So their phone usually has pretty good internet. So they have Pandora off their phone that they can use cellular service. So what we did is we put a Bluetooth module out here in this little waterproof outdoor enclosure so they can Bluetooth music from their phone and play it on the system out here while watching direct TV. Um, stay tuned and always remember, a true outdoor TV is the way to go. You guys have a great choice day.